Hey, what's up? It's Mr. Baker. Does he teach English? Habla Espanol? Is he a farmer? Is he a missionary? Man, I don't know. Call me what you want, just don't call me late for lunch. Let me tell you about the third coast. Hey, like I said, what's up? Good afternoon. Buenas tardes. Konnichiwa. Privyet. Wherever you are in the world, what's up and good afternoon. Today's video is brought to you by the sweet sound of silence. All right, so it is the last Friday of the month, and that means Epi Training Day. So all the Nicaraguan teachers are with the Ministry of Education, and us gringos, us white folk, well, I'm just working in my classroom. But today, I'm coming back to talk to you about avocados and what's going on with the avocado trees. Before we get started, come on, man. You got to follow us. You know you want the updates. Don't be stingy. Hit the like button and tell all your friends. Hit the like button. <laughs> How could you say no to those faces? All right, let's get on with the video. So if you've been following the avocado videos, which you should be, then you know that yesterday sprinkled some eggshells in the soil to use as a natural fertilizer. And I mentioned in the notes of the video that I started, I've been seeing some black and brown kind of spotting on the leaves and I was curious what it is. So I did a little research and it turns out it's a type of common fungus. So I'm going to flip the camera around, give you a view of what I can see on the trees to help you with something you may see in the future. All right. So on this first one, it's a little hard to see with the light. But you see that it's kind of it looks like there's some white specks in there, but there's some brown creeping up uh, on this one. There's some black and brown. This one's doing pretty good. Nothing on that one. This one's rolling along. I don't know what's up with this one. Um, so here, here's the oldest one, and it's kind of the most prominent showing of, of what I'm talking about. So see that on the leaf right there. And then on the leaves right here, right here, and right here. I'm going to take care of it with uh, something natural I saw. I'm also going to chop these two leaves off and uh, just be done with those and go on from there. So the natural fungicide or whatever you want to call it that uh, I was reading about, there's several different one, different run. <laughs> there are several different ones online. So, I mean, do a Google search. It'll take you 10 seconds to find about 20 different kinds. So the one I'm going to do is a mixture of hydrogen peroxide and water. I bought some spray bottles this morning so I could do this. So I'm going to mix it up real quick. And just in case you're curious, it says one part hydrogen peroxide, 3% for nine parts of water. Uh, we're not exactly scientific in the English classroom. So I'm going to eyeball it and uh, get back to you. All right, so there you have it. We got one part hydrogen peroxide to roughly nine parts of water in a spray bottle. So now we're going to apply it to the trees. All right, so here's the first one. I don't know exactly how much I'm supposed to spray. So I'm going to get everything a good, good little dousing. This one didn't have any evidence of it. Neither did this one or this one. So we're going to, but this one's close to that one. So I think I'm going to give it a little... A little spraying this one for sure this is the oldest one this one is about to be one year old believe it or not started back in November it's been going strong it's not exactly the biggest but it's chugging right along all right this one's got a little bit over there Oops, sorry, Mr. Spider. All right, so that's that. I'll go ahead and give these ones, I guess, just a little light one, even though I said I wouldn't, just to be careful. Yeah, 
and there you have it all right so there you have it everything got sprayed with the water hydrogen peroxide mix uh, tomorrow we have Saturday classes, so I'll be back in the morning. I'll be sure to give a look to the plants, and uh, Lily will take care of them. Say hi, Lily. Hi. Say what's up. What's up? Que pasa? Nothing. Bienvenidos. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we'll give it a look. Hopefully everything looks good tomorrow. I'll do some more research and figure out how many times you're supposed to do it. I assume it's until it gets better. So we'll go with that. If I read and hear anything different, I will let you know. That's it. Adios. <laughs>